tell you about the best parts of the West Hollywood gay parades. Fine. Even though the first gay parade was in 1970 in Hollywood, the first gay parade in West Hollywood wasn't until 1979. Don't you even ask if I was at the first gay parade in West Hollywood in 1979. You know I'm far too young for that. Of course you are, sweetheart. So what was the first West Hollywood gay parade like? The West Hollywood gay parades got more and more popular every year. And by the 1990s, they were attracting some 250,000 people. I did my research. Didn't your husband Jeffrey march in a lot of the gay parades? Well, yes, as a matter of fact, my husband Jeffrey did march in the gay parade every year. He's been a great friend to the gay community. <laughs> That's an understatement. What did you say? No, what I meant to say was I so admire the way that you and Jeffrey are so embracing, open-minded, and accepting of other people. Oh, thank you, and you too, dear. Oh, how sweet of you to say. Well, I've had a lot of practice with my siblings. I'm your only sibling. Exactly. But can we get back to the tour, please? I didn't think we ever left. Did you know that practically all the celebrities who were grand marshals of the West Hollywood Gay Parade were women? I was just about to tell you about the famous celebrities who were grand marshals of the West Hollywood Gay Parade, like Elizabeth Montgomery. Oh, I loved her in Bewitched when she twitched her little nose. Cindy Lauper, girls just want to have fun. Kathy Griffin, she's hilarious. Paris Hilton and her mom, Kathy Hilton. Oh, they're so pretty. Carol Channing, well, hello, Dolly. And Patty Duke, I don't know who she is. Yeah, did you notice that you only named women? Why weren't there any men on that list of Grand Marshals of the West Hollywood Gay Parade? Well, I think they were just too busy. Oh, wrong again. The men were just too afraid to be associated with gay rights. I think it's really interesting that famous women celebrities were the first people to publicly stand up and embrace LGBT pride. Well, now that is something to think about. And I have something else for you to think about. And I don't know how to tell you. I have some big news. Some might even say earth-shattering news. And I don't really know how to tell you. Oh, Lord, what now?